Welcome back to the breakdown. Today's quick tip of the day is how to update your Roku TV or Roku streaming player. Now, Roku TVs and Roku streaming players are two different things, but they both update the same way. They both have the same OS, even if the color is a little bit different. We're gonna show you exactly how to quickly update it so you have the latest features and all your apps get updated with the latest updates so they work properly. It's very simple to do. We'll show you one quick second. First though, could you do me a favor? Hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, let YouTube know you enjoy what we do here. So it recommends our videos to more people, helping us grow, helping us support our families, hopefully helping you break free from the high cost of um, TV and stream what you want here or make a right purchasing decision. All right, let's dive into it. Starting off with right here at the Fire, uh, Roku home screen with this, I almost read Fire TV and said it, go up to settings and in settings go over and then select systems and then scroll down to where it says software update. And all you do there is click on check now and it will update. So once again, from the home screen on the left side here, no matter if this is purple or red, select settings, go up to system, go down to uh, software update, click on this and hit check now. And there it will check and tell you if you have a update. That is all you have to do. It is that simple. If you want to update though, just one particular app, you can just select whatever app or Roku channels they like to call them, hit the star key on your remote, the little asterisk key. And then in here is an option to check for updates and it will check for an update just for that particular app. Now, anytime your uh, Roku channel apps are not working properly, that's the first thing I will do. Roku will auto upgrade overnight if you leave it plugged in, but if you don't wanna wait for the auto upgrade, cause that can happen who knows when, you can always check. Anytime you're having problems with yours, checking for an update should be the um, second thing you do after you unplug it from the wall, wait a little bit and plug it back in, let it do a hard reboot. Well, that's it for today. I hope you like this quick tip of the day. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. Otherwise, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, let YouTube know you enjoy what we do here. Thanks for your support.